said he was feeling lightheaded. Is he infected from when Santa vomited on him? He should go to isolation. He's in hypoglyce. Semic shock. Give him D50. Dr. Glassman? Hi. We got what we needed for images. You are okay to go. We'll send them to Dr. Blaze. Anything I should be worried about? You're seeing Dr. Blaze before the holiday? As a matter of fact, I'm seeing her now, so I could just show her the hard copy. I'm not supposed to do that. Oh, no, I know. I've been a neurosurgeon for like 100 years. I understand protocol. I'm not going to look at it. I just want to move things along. Thank you. It's back. I must admit the branch of the inferior mesenteric artery. Can't see where. Can you feel it? I think so. Use your finger to plug the hole. Now what? Dr. Lim? Crowning, Dr. Murphy? No, she's dilated at six centimeters and I don't feel the head. It's been seven hours since her water broke. The baby's stuck. Use Leopold's maneuvers to identify the location of the baby. <sighs> the 
fetus is transverse. He's lying roughly oh. 30 degrees to the left side. We can't deliver the baby. What? Why not? We need to turn the baby. We need to do an external cephalic version. Or a C-section. I have assisted on several. In operating rooms with an experienced attendant, we are not doing a C-section here. Tilt her bed. I'll grab the gel. Mm. Okay. Oh. When... What? <clears throat> when what? I get not telling him when he's in quarantine he's got enough on his plate, but... Never? You told him when you were first diagnosed. Yes, and that was a mistake. He forced you to take tests that saved your life. Well, no, as it turns out, it didn't. And he became so obsessed and distracted that he nearly killed a patient. He's your friend. I'm his mentor. It's not his job to take care of me. You ready, Dr. Murphy? Yes, I can feel the head. We need to rotate in the same direction. Deep breaths, Viola. <laughs> I can't! I can't do this! Squeeze my arm hard as you can! <laughs> The fetus is moving. Head is facing the cervix. One more push. We just need to stop. Placental abruption. She's hemorrhaging. Baby's heart rate is decelerating. I need two large bore IV lines and start two units PRBC. Then please page an OBGYN to supervise my first solo surgery. This is terrible. This is not how it's supposed to This is excellent. Dr. Garcia will be supervising me for the C-section. She's the director of obstetrics and gynecology here. I'm sure she's much more qualified than your personal OBGYN. Relax, you're gonna be fine. What's the status? Nerve block is in, and I gave her a liter bolus of saline. Throw some chloroprep down and make a five centimeter fan and steel incision. Blade. Abdomen is open. Retraction. Suction. Baby's BPM is 110 and dropping. What's happening? Dr. Murphy, do you see the uterine wall? Blood pressure is dropping. Dr. Murphy, the uterine wall. Dr. Murphy? You need to make a gradual shallow incision and cut through it. You do not want to nick the baby. What's happening? BPM is 95. Dr. Murphy, please. Dr. Murphy, should we turn Dr. up her Murphy, oxygen? Dr. Murphy, you need to make the cut. Dr. Murphy, Dr. Murphy. Okay. Dr. Murphy. Dr. Murphy. Okay. No. Quiet. Everyone quiet. I need to concentrate. I can see the head. <sighs> Is my baby okay? He's not breathing. We need to start CPR now. Get a pediatric ambu bag and start two finger mm. chest compressions. There's something wrong with Viola. She's hypotensive and tachycardic. She's bleeding out. <laughs> 